In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you a complete PowerPoint presentation deck with seven slides. So let me just show you how the presentation looks. This is the first uh, title slide where I have used the background image. And then when I click, you can see here I've added some kind of a design and then you can add your presentation title here. So this is the, the title slide. And then the second slide is about the introduction. You can add any uh, headline here and then you can add some detailed text and then the next slide is the content slide where you can add the content of your slide and then comes about us you can see here i've added some few animations for the about us and then the next slide is about our team where you can introduce the team here and then it comes the projects you can see here you can add the projects and the detailed text here and likewise you can add as many slides as you want depending on your requirement so this is the project slide and then the last slide which is says thank you so let's see how to do this in powerpoint and before that one if you have not subscribed to my channel powerpoint university please subscribe it now and make sure to enable the bell notification icon you can join my telegram group with the help of this link and if you like to contribute to my channel you can do it through paypal or patreon the link is provided in the video description section so let's start the tutorial so let's add the first slide the title slide for that let me just go to insert shapes and from the rectangles i can draw this right triangle you can see here so right triangle i'm just drawing something like this shape outline make it no outline and shape fill you can just choose any color of your choice and then i'm just going to rotate it you can see here flip vertical and here how much you want the width you can just increase it and then i'm going to duplicate it before duplicating i want to edit this one i want to make it a curve shape here for that right mouse click go to edit points you can see here the three small uh, black squares here so i'm just going to select the bottom one and you can see here the two white here so this white square i'm just going to drag this inside you can see here and then i'm going to select this as well as this also i'm just going to drag it here so make sure that the shape should be perfect and then if you are satisfied this one it's okay if not again right mouse click edit points and then you can just align it perfectly depending on your requirement you can see here something like this now let me just duplicate this press ctrl d to duplicate bring to the other side and i'm going to flip horizontal again rotate flip vertical and i'm going to place it here so you can see here i got this shape now i'm going to add one image here in the center for that go to insert shapes select the rectangle draw the rectangle covering the whole slide you can see here something like this shape outline make it no outline and i'm going to send this to back now i want to add an image here right mouse click go to format shape and under fill select picture or texture fill so i'm just going to click this one i have used this uh, image in the uh, i mean before so that's the reason it's coming if not you can just go click on insert either you can add it from the your local pc or if you are connected to the net you can do it from there or if you have some icons also you can do it so i'm just going to select it from the my local pc and then select the image so we end up getting an image something like this now depending on your requirement you can just change the color so i'm just going to select this one maybe i'm going to choose some different color here you can see here if you want one color two colors it's up to you so that's the first slide and then let's add some title here i'm just going to say the presentation title presentation title and let me make it center align i'm going to make it white font any font of your choice make it bold and increase it you can see here and then just align it properly do the proper formatting and you can just place it here so this is my first slide and if you want to add some uh the company logo or the company name you can just add it here for example go to insert text box and i'm going to just type company name here all right and then i can just 
put it here if you have the logo also you can just add the logo so this is the first presentation uh, title slide and then uh, let's uh, let me just show you how to make the other slides now let me just show you how to create uh, this uh, particular about a slide so right mouse click i'm going to make it new slide here and i'm going to select and delete this one i don't want and let me just draw one rectangle here for the title or for the headlines here you can see here depending on your requirement you can increase or decrease the size shape outline make it no outline then i want to cut the one end for that let me just go to the title slide i'm going to select this Control c bring it here Control v paste you can see here and then i'm going to reduce the size all right and then i'm going to place it exactly here and let me just do something like this okay and make sure that it should be properly aligned and then i'm going to select the blue one hold the shift key select the the orange one go to format merge shape and i'm going to make it subtract all right and shape fill use the same color what we have used here all right and then i can just say that about us i'm going to type it about us and white font choose any font of your choice increase the size if you want you can make it bold also i'm going to copy it here all right now let's add the other shapes which are these shapes so for that go to insert shapes and from the rectangles i'm going to choose this one which is rectangles diagonal corners rounded and i'm going to select something like this and then you got two orange points and i'm going to drag this inside okay so it looks something like this again depending on your requirement you can increase or decrease the size shape outline i'm going to make it no outline go to insert shapes and i'm going to select the rectangle draw the rectangle here you can see here something like this shape outline make it no outline shape fill you can give any color of your choice and if you want you can just increase or decrease also so you can see here i can just and then what i'm going to do i'm going to subtract this one or i can just do a fragment so let me just duplicate this by pressing ctrl d for my future use so i'm going to select both this shape by holding the shift key go to format merge shape and i can just say fragment so this is not see can you see here now i'm going to bring this one here and exactly place it in the center here all right now depending on my requirement i can just choose the color i'm going to select this and i'm going to give some dark color here and here i'm going to choose and choose some light color or orange color and this area i'm going to insert the picture again by default the same picture has come and then you can just remove this rotate with shape and then you can just play with this one you can see here left right you can just adjust it according to your requirement if you want to change the image you can just go to insert maybe if you are using uh, if you are having connected to the network you can just or internet sorry you can just add any image of your choice and depending on your internet speed the the image will display for example uh, say that i want to use some backgrounds and i want to use maybe this background for example and click on insert you can see here that particular image will be added here all right and then i can just go to insert text box i can add the title here center align again choose the same font if you want make it bold and then you can just add some detailed text here all right let me just center align this one again if you want make it black font or white font depending on your requirement you can just adjust it and then i'm going to select this one move it here press ctrl d to duplicate add one more again press ctrl d add one more so you can see here i've added like this and then i can just go here and then again change the picture according to my requirement all right and if you want to have some kind of a theme here i can just select this one you can see here 
select this press ctrl c ctrl v and i'm going to just reduce the size you can see here something like this also you can make it all right so these are the two slides i have made now let's see the animation for this so let me just select the first slide close the format background animations enable the animation pane and i'm going to select this first here you can see here and i'm going to say fly in you can just say fly in effect options maybe i'm going to say from top left it comes something like this and this also i'm going to select again fly in and this one should come from bottom right all right and that should happen at previous okay and then you can select both of these right mouse click effect options and you can increase the bounce and if you write if you like and then make it timings you want fast medium slow you can just uh, put the duration depending on your requirement and click ok so it comes something like this and then this one title i'm going to more entrance effect and i'm going to select basic zoom and that should happen after previous so if i play it comes something like this all right we can see here so this is the first slide now let's go to the second slide and do some animations before doing the animation let me just group this one this one as well as this by holding the shift key i'm going to group it you can see here press ctrl g i'm grouping this again this also i'm going to group it otherwise if i don't group i have to do uh, the animations two three times all right so now I'm going to select this one or you can select all of these three also and I can just make it fly in so it comes something like this all right and then depending on your requirement this one if you want it should come from top I'm going to say this come from top and maybe this one it should come from left and this one should come from bottom only all right so if I play it comes something like this you can see here all right now it's easy for me based on my depending on my requirement i'm going to animation painter click on this again i'm going to select this here and then i'm going to select for this option so if you see here this is the first option then comes the second option likewise you can just do the the other option so similarly i've just made all the titles or the slide depending on this small animation effect only all right